Welcome back. In this video, we are going to see if we can find uh, the sign in option for security key one. So, if I click here and go to the accounts, I've been try I tried that before. So, this one is only for manage. If you see, it's a, it does not say setup, it says manage. So, it's a over here, it's saying insert your security key into the USB port. So, this if I go to a website like I can search for it <coughs> actually I did over here and I need to go to this, this page so I can search create create of course it's slow now so Microsoft wants you really wanted you to use the Microsoft account for, to sign into Windows but of course that is not an option when you are connected to a domain so uh, not this one this will be so there are other um, softwares that you can use Rojos, UB key something like that that will create a security key for you but those are the third party thing this one is for windows so it says sign into windows with the security key go to your microsoft account page and sign is as you normally would and select set up a security key so why don't we rather than to go through clicks go directly there so it's asking me to um yeah i can choose that account and it it has saved my password it's gonna send me a text message Yep, send me a text message. And I have received the text message. Um, let's pause the video here. It is verifying the text, and there you go. It's saying set up your security key. It's a USB device or NFC. So USB device is our normal USB. NFC is near field communication drive and uh, your phone has NFC chip as well so but it's a UFC one security key so since we we're not going to use the phone we're going to do with the USB because I don't think so we can use the phone but with the, this NFC chip it could be in form of any a small USB or something like that so you don't have to actually plug it in into your computer it just needs to be within a certain distance that is most of the time it's like when you tap your credit card on the uh, reader it's like about a few maybe one or two um, inches or less than that it, so something went wrong the security key is you setting up your security key cancel the security key used is not supported security key and oh it has to be a special device in that case let's go here and see if we can use your security key with logon so since it's a uh, virtual machine probably that's why it did not work so I'm gonna see a record of your visit to the site will be kept on your security key continue it is in there so I think security key USB is different than your normal USB that's why it's doing that it isn't there I can actually unplug it and plug it back in
so at the moment there are all third-party software that can do this oh windows bitlocker So this video is a bust but it's a good video we uh, I'm glad I made this video I am tempted to go and turn on the bit locker bit on this computer but uh, <clears throat> again then most of the like I know some companies they don't use bit locker so let's wrap this video here knowing that how we know how to create a USB security key it has to be done with a third-party software uh, that actually supports it and it's not like uh, once created it will unlock these specific uh, accounts for you or the computer itself so I can go here as well nope, nope here and um, one prompted <coughs> if I unplug it what happens it says when prompted next nope it's not working all right, so let's exit out of here and go to C drive and see can we turn on BitLocker on on one of our virtual machines. Turn on BitLocker. Okay, so BitLocker is not being used in here. We can shut down this virtual machine. It has served its purpose for right now <coughs> I'm gonna cancel it here something where let's go to here <coughs> and see if we can turn bitlocker here without a compatible TPM let's go and enable TPM in our motherboard all right so let's wrap this video here this video is a total bust in terms of we cannot set up the USB uh, device as a security key but then again it needs to be done with the software <clears throat> I'm gonna go find some more information and update this one thank you for watching and you have a good night